alrighty, so I just thought about like like a great analogy. Um, so I'm walking outside, but I wanted to record it before it uh, I forgot. Uh, I just thought like like how uh, how you know uh, uh, how uh, <coughs> How Denmark is like, it's like, uh, um, it's like a Josef Fritzl's basement, you know, like, like where, you know, Fritzl, that's like the government or something, you know, like Danish government, and then, you know, the citizens are like, just, you know, <laughs> uh, uh, sorry for laughing, uh, Elizabeth Fritzl, uh, like, and then like creating like a lot of like inbred things, you know. So, uh, yeah, anyway, that's what I wanted to say. You know? yeah. Also, by the way, I, um, I mean, this is all like nitpicking about reality, but. I mean, uh, like I'm writing my autobiography, and uh, uh, what was what's this? Uh, <coughs> what was this? Is open? Or? Oh no! Again. So, uh, <coughs> but anyway, I was just like. Just got to thinking about the movie, The Black Phone. I mean, it's just a really shitty movie. Like, just really. Ir I just don't understand how you can. How you can think that's a, that's a good horror movie. <coughs> a good movie? Yeah, yeah, maybe. A good horror movie? What? I mean, just. What? <coughs> I mean, it's just. That's just unbelievable to me. How anybody could can say should say that or would say that. I mean, actually, I mean it's like it's the case with the King family. Uh, like uh, just Stephen King, you know, Joe Hill, you know, his son, who wrote the Black Phone. I mean, it's just like when you look at like the writing. I mean, it's like probably like ninety nine percent or something, ninety nine for nine, ninety seven percent or something. It's like complete social realism, you know, with, with like people, you know, like Shawshank Redemption and stuff like that, you know, like or like just you know people like who are like you know struggling to get a job and you know like like mundane stuff, you know, mundane relations, mundane uh, uh, stuff like. I mean, I, I don't know, <laughs> I mean, I mean, it's just, it's just, it's just, honestly, I mean, it's, it's insane to call, to call Stephen King a master of horror, uh, even in his best book, which is probably it, uh, you have to, like, it's only, like, uh, every 50 pages or something that, Anyway, it appears, you know, so. And, uh, well, I read Christine, that was one of the first books I ever read at all, and I thought it was pretty good at that young age. Uh, but, uh, in terms of, like, horror, uh, I mean, uh, uh, uh like, it's like pretty stupid in a way, isn't it? I mean, I don't know. I mean, what's the horror element? Of, I mean, uh. uh. 
but but anyway, uh, early king was was much 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 better. But I'm, I'm just saying, like even even a book like like Christine that I have a like a special relations with, and like I, I would like read King when I was like like really young, and uh, I would like read like stuff like Salem Blood and and also Needful Things and uh, the Dark Half and you know and, and Christine as I mentioned, but. <sighs> Kujo, stuff like that, you know, it's just like, just like <sighs> yeah, anyway, well, what I'm just saying is, I, I just don't see, as I see, I mean, I mean, a good horror movie, that's something like what Damien Leone does, something like, like Terrifier 2, uh, like, where you're like, to the point. You know, you're making a good, good horror villain out the clown. And that, that's no political bullshit. Or like, even a, like a Serbian film, I mean, that's, that's a good horror movie in my opinion, because it's like honest, you know. Just, you know, how shitty reality is, and, you know, any, but anyway, I just, yeah, I, I was just like, uh, just like I uh, just got sort of like irritated by. Also, I saw a really shitty movie uh, called uh, uh, "Lose It" with Billy Zane from from Twin Peaks. He's the guy who he's the guy who uh, who uh, who was. Uh, maybe you already know the who is, but. He was the guy who was like the love interest of, of Audrey in Twin Peaks. You know, the beautiful, sexy uh, woman, uh, Audrey. Uh, And he's in that movie, but uh, you know, But I mean, just uh, also just a horrible, horrible movie. I mean, just absolute shit. You know, <laughs> it's just really, it's it's really unbelievable in a way. Like like uh, like like how uh, like what what's fucking wrong with people? Like 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 also I mean, like like how they shut people down. You know, like. Uh, it was like Jay Dyer said, you know, they have to shut people down and deplatform them because they don't have any, uh, they can't compete, you know, they, they don't have any, they don't have any arguments or evidence or anything for that fucking bullshit. So they just have to try to shut the people down, ignore them or something, just, just to, and it's, it's the same with like movies and stuff, like, uh, like a great movie like Terrify 2, it doesn't doesn't even get, uh, it doesn't get, uh, get like, the, 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 what do you call it, get, uh, 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 you, you, uh you know, I don't, I, I mean, the, it's not on Google, Google Films, you know, but the shit is on Google Films, you know, so, so it's like, uh, 
absolute crap, you know. Absolute fucking bullshit. <laughs>